Yo, whoa, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Dan, aka Drive, for you guys a brand new video today, and today I'm going to show you how to get Rotom and the various Rotom forms in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. If you guys find this video helpful and you enjoy it, be sure to hit that like button down below, and make sure you guys subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on our epic Pokemon content. Without further ado, it's pretty simple. Once you get access to the National Dex, which comes from beating the main part of the game and ultimately getting to the post game, you can head over here to Eternal Forest and cut down the tree. By cutting down the tree, you can then gain access to this mansion, and that's going to be the secret ticket to getting Rotom. There's a fun little text there with Gardenia where she kind of talks about how she's too scared to go in herself, but we're not too scared, so we're going to head right into the uh, into the mansion. Ah, oh, look at the creepy guy running away. See you later, buddy. In order to find Rotom, it's quite simple. You go up into the into the mansion, the old chateau. You're going to head over here, head into this room right now. You're going to want to save the game. I highly recommend. And then once you've saved your game, you simply can talk to the TV, and there's a Pokemon that wants to come out. You thump the TV, and then Rotom is going to pop out. You can soft reset this for a shiny, by the way. So if anyone's interested in trying to get a shoddy Rotom, this would be an awesome way to do it. But just a reminder, you can actually breed Rotom with Ditto to get a bunch of different Rotoms. So if you wanted to breed for it, that's your better chance. Now, as you can see, Rotom is only level 15. So be prepared to battle him at a low level and be ready to weaken him and try to catch him because he may be a little bit difficult to catch. Of course, because I'm filming a video, life is going to work very nicely for me, and I'm going to catch him on my first quick ball. Once you capture Rotom, he's going to drop the secret key on the ground, and that's going to be the secret tech in order for you to get access to the hidden room that allows you to change Rotom's form. Once you get that secret key and capture your Rotom, you can go back to Eternacity, right next to where the old Chateau is, and you can work your way into the old uh, building for Team Galactic. This is actually where you're going to find the room to access the Rotom stuff. So you head over here to this corner, you use the secret key against the secret wall, and ultimately you get access to the secret room. And in this room, you can use the various appliances to change the form on your Rotom. So if you want Rotom to become the Rotom, the motor form, or the oven form rather, you can put it in there. You can use the air form, the fan form, the fridge form, the wash form, and of course, the mo form. And that basically gives you different types, right? You have the fire type, the flying type, the ice type, the water type, and of course, the grass type. And they all have their signature moves overheat air slash blizzard hydro pump and leaf storm respectively you can easily interchange your rotom here whenever you want it works for the rotom you catch in the old chateau and rotoms that you breed with ditto so this is a phenomenal pokemon and a fun little secret for pokemon brilliant diamond and shining pearl i personally like the fridge form the most with blizzard i think he's the coolest and just a fun little fact once you change rotom's form once you can change it into every single form it drops the root Rotom catalog, and then you can easily interchange it on the go. You don't have to come back to the room. So my recommendation is the first time you come here, just turn them into all the different forms, get them in your catalog, and then from there, you should be good to go. And look at my little fridge Rotom walking with me. Actually, looks pretty amazing. He's super tiny. That's the tiniest fridge I've ever seen. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button down below. And again, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new for epic Pokemon content. I post Pokemon videos every single day. That's going to be for me, guys. My name is Dan. I also go by A-Drive. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.